Hello everyone. In this video, we will go over the MainWP API backups. In version 5 of the MainWP dashboard, API backups has become a core feature of the dashboard and thus available to everyone for free. And in version 5, we've also added support for cPanel and Plesk. API backups allows you to make backups and restorations directly on your hosting provider via the MainWP dashboard. Let's head to the API backup settings and set up a hosting provider. Click the ellipsis menu in the top right, then settings, and then open the API backups page. Currently, we support Cloudways, Gridpane, Vulture, Akamai, DigitalOcean, and since version 5, cPanel and Plesk. More providers are coming, so stay tuned. The instructions for connecting each of the providers are shown on their respective tabs, and it usually entails little more than entering the API key and email address. We have a couple of test sites hosted on Cloudways, so let's set that up. We've previously grabbed our API key from the URL indicated in the instructions here, so now we just have to toggle on the Cloudways API, enter our account email and API key, and click Save Settings. Let's now move to the API Backups page, which is located under Sites. Here we see a list of all of our child sites, and in the column provider we can see which hosting provider is associated with a particular child site. From here you can request backups for an individual site by clicking on the ellipsis menu and then Backup, or you can request backups in bulk by selecting multiple sites and then clicking on the Backup Selected Sites button. Once you successfully request a backup, you will see a notification in the top right corner. To manage backups for a particular site, you again click on the ellipsis menu next to the desired child site and then manage backups. Here, you will see a list of all available backups for this child site, and to restore a backup, simply click the restore icon of a desired backup. To avoid hitting the API rate limits of some providers, we have added a button to refresh the list of available backups manually. So if you are not seeing some recent backups and you expected them to be here, remember to click that button to fetch the most recent list. We hope you found the walkthrough useful and thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like and subscribe for more updates from MainWP.